Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to attempt to reshape my motorcycle seat. Fingers crossed, let's see how it goes. Let's get into it. All right, so for the first step, I need to get the original seat cover off of the seat so I'm going to be using uh, this staple remover tool and pliers okay so now that I removed the staples I'm going to go ahead and remove two nuts right here that are holding the strap for the seat and I'll be using a 10 millimeter socket Alright, cover is off and the strap. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys like the stock seat, well the cover. I thought it would be a good idea to change it because I like more of a retro look and I thought it'd be a good opportunity to get rid of some foam. Since I am a short gal, I thought taking a little bit of foam off would help so I could plant my feet more on the floor. Got two more staples here. Alright. Now we're going to mark the foam with a sharpie. So I have a guide on where I need to cut. All right, guys, time to make the big cut. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little nervous. I'm not a professional, so obviously um, take my words of advice with a grain of salt, but let's see how it goes. Time to cut. Alright guys, so I got the seat to a point that I'm pretty satisfied with. So now I'm going to go ahead and sand it down with a sander and just to smooth it out all these imperfections and um, put the cover on. Alright guys, so after several hours later... <laughs> We finally got it to where I wanted it. Thank you, Camilo, my hubby, for helping me out with smoothing it out and making it very nice. Um, there are obviously some imperfections. Again, we're not professionals. Um, like right here and right here. I'm just going to go ahead and cover it with crazy glue and like some foam that we used from earlier. So that will help, you know diminish those imperfections but i'm very happy we're gonna go ahead and put the cover on now so stay tuned all right so once the cover is fitted on um what you're gonna do is pretty much start by putting staples uh, back where you know they were before um, and you should start in the front and back of the seat and obviously stretch it as much as you can um, and then once we do that we'll start going on the sides and making sure everything is nice and tight guys so this is the result uh, went ahead and put all the staples to fasten the cover on the seat and overall i'm really really happy with the results now all that stuff to do is put the strap that came with it on of course this is optional uh, but i prefer it because it helps me when i'm parking my bike obviously since i'm short i have to get off and like i put my hand on the seat and having the strap on helps me 
reverse it. So yeah, this is next. All right, guys, so I put on the strap. It looks so nice. See, you see, this is what I meant. The back of my bike better like this, you see? All right, so um, made some holes with a drill bit and now I just attached the washers on it and the nut and so now I just gotta tighten it with the 10 millimeter socket. All right guys, that is it for today's video. I am very happy with the results. Obviously, I'm not a professional. This is my first time doing it. I was actually inspired by Rogue Motorcycles. They actually perform this service where you pretty much uh, send your seat in to them and they go ahead and reupholster the whole chair for you and you got pretty much a new seat in the mail obviously though i didn't want to cash out on 600 plus dollars um because i am saving for other parts for the motorcycle um so i went ahead and just got the cover uh for like 140 bucks and just did the work myself with the tools i had um let me know down in the comments below what you guys think again i'm very very happy i'll let you guys know how how it rides because obviously i have to sit in it test it out myself thank you guys for watching stay tuned i'll see you on the next one